What's up, guys? Ew, it's fucking gay month, except it's not gay month, so we're gonna play it's Life is Gay. It's not gay month anymore. Fuck, wait. Nope. We missed it. Did you wait just so you could do it on camera? I didn't actually wait. So, like, this is, like, a cool idea, but, like, also... Like... I'm sure it's also, like, for if everybody forgets their fucking bottle opener. That's pretty cool. Yeah? It, 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 it comes in here. Okay. Everybody! We're playing Life is Strange, guys. We are. Uh, so I hope that you're fucking immersed in that beautiful guitar music. This is actually a pretty cool game. I've played it before. Matt hasn't played it. He knows that there's gay. I, that's the only thing I know. I know that it gets gay. Yeah. There is gay. Wow. Open the lights. No, my eyes. Happy 4th of July, by the way. It's not gonna be for we just so, dated this episode. Yeah. I did that. Well I mean we dated it that it wasn't a game on it. Shut up. We get the flight. Oh. I'm scared. Oh, whoa, what was that? Oh, she's on the ground. Okay. It looked kinda like she was like on top of something, but this this is us. We're gonna go we're gonna be some fucking foot on my face. We're gonna be Samantha. What? That's our name. No. We don't name ourselves. Oh. What's happening? What is happening? Girl? That's a good question. But I assume that the game is going to tell us soon. Is it? No. How did I get here? How did you get here? Where is here? That's a nice haircut. Haircut? Yeah. Wait, okay. The looks like a uh, looks like you got Play-Doh on your head. I hope. Please it's just the art style, man. It is an interesting art style. I really like it. Dude, remember when we played Oxenfree and we had to deal with the fucking lighthouse? Yeah, man, that's exactly back. what I fucking thought. Lighthouse. We're back, Lighthouse, guys. Oxenfree was probably our best series. It was. Especially because this is like the only one that finished. Is there. We finished Shovel Knight. Uh, is there. Is there a character. And we finished Star Fox, but that's not up yet. Uh, oh, shit. I forgot we played. Go on. Is there, is, there an, uh, is there a character in this game that wears a fucking uh, beanie? For me to smash. Ah, fuck. Yeah, For there you is. Smash? Except you're, you're gonna learn that I hate most characters in this game. Love this game. All the characters have very like powerful characters, so it's not like I hate these characters because like they're really oh, shit, shit like developed. Yeah. Everybody is a fantastically developed character. I just hate their personalities. Every single one of them. Wow. Does she have a fucking doe on her shirt. Yeah. That's a deer. That's a deer. A female deer. Nice for clarifying. That was so surreal. <laughs> this dream. She fell asleep in the middle of her class while the teacher's looking at her. As he likely was. Okay. I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. That's me every single day in class. To Kira Skiro. Kira, what? Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't fall asleep. Uh, the guy that takes the pictures of the girls who play with. She didn't even fall asleep. She didn't fall asleep? No, yeah, man. Alright, so we're gonna be fucking- we're gonna- Okay, wait, real quick. Look at those fucking disgusting drawings. Real, real, real quick. Uh-huh. So I wanna ask you something. Yes. So do you wanna do a completion- Gay. Gay. Oh. So you don't wanna- do you wanna do a- Fuck, I should've asked you this before we started recording. I thought so. Maybe not. You don't uh, have to if you don't wanna. Do you wanna do a perfect playthrough? Or do you wanna fuck? What's a perfect playthrough and what's, what's the difference? Uh, just like getting the best friend in me, that kind of shit. Uh, do you play? Okay, but is perfect the perfect, ending. the perfect ending? The, do we get to do gay shit? Yeah. Oh, then we're fine. <laughs> I just want there to be as much gay. Biggest gays. All right, that means that like there will be pauses for me to look up tutorials. Like I know generally how to get there, but like. That's fine. Yeah. As yeah. Long as all right. As cool. long as gay happens. I just... All right. Cause my first playthrough, I went straight. And anyways. Oh, yeah, that's why you fucking lost it. 
how can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. No, it's a nice picture. It is. I mean, except it's supposed to, like, represent that she has anxiety and, like, she's, like, not confident in herself and has low self-esteem. That, that, that's perfect. Like Show him that fucking disgusting drawing. Uh, but I just one of the fucking guy. Tortured, right? Take a and selfie. I love my analog camera. Uh, we are going to. I should take a, a quick picture now. Pencil case. Oh, I'm trying to look at the journal. I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. So basically, the journal is. Mm. What would they think? Oh, she's 18. She's still flat as fuck. 18. Anyways, uh, so the journal is basically, it just keeps oh dear. track of everything, so, like, we can read this all. Yeah, but it's just, like, like whenever you do something in the game, it goes in the journal? Yeah, it, like, progresses. This oh, is they're also, there are eight pages of it already. Seattle. And so this is, like, stuff that, like, backstory. you know, so we could read this. I was hanging out with Chloe, and then Tyler showed up, and Tyler oh, was like, you. oh my god. Tyler looked cute today. He was wearing a Vans shirt, which means he's cool. Matt was wearing a band shirt earlier. But no, I'm not, not now. He's not anymore. So now you're fucking. No, fuck. I'm not cool. God damn, you're disgusting. And any one of you could do that to me. Look at my pencil case. I can't believe so I still have this. Is that sad fucking sad grimace from McDonald's? I, I thought it was the fucking, you know, the sad egg thing? Yeah. I don't remember his name. Probably sad Some egg. Japanese. So, Sadu Egu. <laughs> I have to admit. I'm not a big fan of her work. I should take a picture to prove I'm still here. What does she want? Sad egg. <laughs> and I have to get my daily selfie quota. Daily selfie quota. Fucking fulfilled. This is so cringy. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a... The point remains that portraiture has always been a I like that mug in the background. I know, me too. He's so cute. Now, He's Max, so cute. Where'd you say it like that? He's cute. He's a cute boy. Can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first gave birth. self portraits? Uh. <clears throat> you're asking me? Yeah, your name's Max, you right? Let me think. Fucking idiot. Um, you either know this or not, Max. All right, chill the Is fuck out. Nobody cares about your fucking stuff. picture Daguerre class, dude. Who was a French painter who created daguerreotypes? A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Did you just fucking Ew. say sad face out loud? She's the fucking whore. LOL. <laughs> LOL. Winky face. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert. Diva's my main, guys. You can find out all about She's the kind of person that, like... <laughs> Or even like uh, you'll say something kind of funny and then she'll go ha retweet. Hey guys, don't forget the deadline to Ew. submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. Oh, dude, San Francisco? And it can kickstart a career in photography. That's a place I know. I've been there. Together. Taylor, We've been there together. Don't hide. I'm still waiting for your. We're still right? waiting on that fucking uh, log. Uh, Tommy still has it. Uh, he is fucking doesn't give it to me. Literally, like message him about it because like i've been i will i don't want to say i've been waiting for it but like it's been a year now it's been over a year yeah he's got it let's go look at the mug there it is it's the correct oh. use of colors don't fucking correct use of colors fuck off yeah man i can use colors wherever i want oh dude that's well, obviously blackwell spent bank on the computers here spent bank are you kidding me that's like a fucking like somebody was already working on this <laughs> cool the, you see they they use shading to bring out the cleavage I am in the okay first with image. It. It's, it's I am perfectly fucking okay it's with back it. And it's Cleavage like, is yeah. art. Sent it. All right, guys. Uh, we're gonna look at a. Uh, we're gonna read stuff. Because that's conducive. this gives you your chance. Alex. Alex wants to be a, uh, a voice actor. This gives you your chance to read it. Do it in your best, <clears throat> freshly eighteen, girl voice. <clears throat> I got accepted into Black Book Academy. If words could dance, this would be a rave. Wow. That's actually kind of a cool set. If words could dance, this would be a rave. 
God damn. <laughs> now they can see that shit. Even though I've never been to one, but who cares? Because I got into Blackwell Academy. I didn't think I would be so excited since it's not like I used to live in the same town. But when I saw the text from Blackwell's scholarship office, I could literally feel my pulse beat up. I thought I was going to say sorry, thanks for playing. It. Oh, I. Uh, it took me a few seconds before I read the whole thing. I guess I wanted to enjoy that last moment of blissful ignorance. When I saw the first word, congratulations, I think I screamed. My mom cried and my dad laughed. They're so weird. But they're happy and this means extra financial support because they don't have to pay anything to Blackwell. This means new clothes and if I can work it, a new laptop. Oh. And I have to keep telling myself in caps that I am going to Blackwell Academy. So Real Blackwell quick. Academy is like a photography university. Oh, so, so that's yeah. not where she's going now? That is where she's going. That's oh, she's where going. I am right oh, now. Oh, okay. So, so photography class is important. I was making fun of her earlier. Oh, yeah. No, she's... Yeah. The the line, my mom cried and my dad laughed, it mm. sounds like it's like straight out of, uh, what was it, Ameri like the American Pie song? Yeah, it does. I can't so, remember. Yeah. Threw that out there. Mm -hmm. This is it. So this is it. I'm leaving Seattle to go back to Arcadia Bay. Usually people go to the high school closest to home. I suppose I am to high school, not university. Not really sure. It's not clear. She's it's 18. A, she's eight, Yeah. So that would, so like so it would be university. Well, I mean, why would you need to, an acceptance letter to get? It's like either a private high school that she's getting into. Or well, yeah, but if it's if it's a not sure. if it's like an art school, or like it could be high school, it could be college. Oh, that's, right. that's right. We forgot to do that. Hey, what's up? Matt waved to the camera. What a fucking idiot, right? He's twerking, but you guys can't see because he has no ass. I'm glad that I'm not close to the camera. Can you guys see what kind of beer I'm drinking? It's no good. No down. Usually people go to the high school close to home, I suppose I am too, but uh, it's just that I haven't lived there for five years. Out of all the best photography programs in the world, I chose to go to the smallest. Back in, back in my town, I was excited about leaving. Maybe I wanted to come back all along just to see if Chloe and I are still even friends, but I do wish Chloe could have moved uh, with us to Seattle. That city was made for her, when we would play pirates in our rooms and in the woods. It seemed like Seattle was that fabled faraway island of treasure and adventure. We would play we who could kiss thinking. each other the best. That's where we could be gay. So or Chloe's gay. not the, the blue gay. She is. Oh, so she comes back. You didn't even know what's happening. Okay. So just stop. <laughs> but she just said Chloe couldn't hang out. I, I'm like half listening. This is not in Seattle. This is so we are in Arcadia Bay, which is, in, which is Oregon. In Oregon. Seattle's in Oregon. So now she's so in Seattle's Oregon. in Washington. Seattle's in Oregon. Is it? No. <laughs> <laughs> it is in Washington. I so I said that, and then you're like, I'm Seattle aware. is in Oregon, and I was mocking <laughs> you. You scared me. I was mocking. Anyways, uh, what was I? But Seattle wasn't like a fable. Au contraire. Now Blackwell Academy seems more exotic to me than any other place in the world to study photography under Mark Jefferson. Sigh. Nice Insert okay. hearts and flowers. Plus there will be cool, diverse students from everywhere. It won't be like my high school now. I never really found a groove with my classmates or boys. I'm lucky I have a great couple a couple great friends here, but it's time to ship out. So maybe Arcadia Bay will actually turn out to be the island of treasure and adventure I've been looking for. Page three. Shit is crazy, spelled with a K. Shit's yeah. crazy! I didn't realize how much crap I had to pack until I had to pack all my crap. Mom and Dad are getting a little too excited I'm clearing out my room, though... Uh... Though I caught Mom crying when she was packing my shirts. Sorry. English is hard, guys. That made me want to cry like a little girl and never leave Seattle. So instead of packing, I feel like burning all my clothes and just raiding a thrift store to build up a new Max wardrobe Ew. for my junior year. Not that I even have an old Max wardrobe. Nobody will know me except for Chloe, and who knows how different we are now. So I can cut my hair, get a tat, and some piercings. Maybe date a cute foreign exchange art artiste, not artist. It's got an E at the end. Artiste. It's from artiste. Paris or Rome. Technically, technically it is artiste. Artiste. Uh, from Paris or Rome, I can do anything unless I get busted. There will Busted. be so many super cool chances for my photography to get exposed. Thinking about that is when I get scared, but excited. Then I don't feel like crying at all. I get the tingles down my arms, sensing the universe opening up for me. I can't wait to leave. I just want things to be different. But so, so she did say, she said... So she lived in Arcadia Bay, moved to Seattle. I feel like burning all my clothes, then just raiding a thrift store to build up a new max wardrobe over my junior year. 
She's 18 and a junior? This bitch got held back. She is a photography student. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, um... Dumb art bitch. Art of bitch. Well, we have a word for those in the engineering department. Cashiers. Sorry. <laughs> My first entry from my new dorm room the night before my first day at Blackwell. Woo. Oh shit, wait, real quick. This is, these are dated in 2013. Mm -hmm. She's like 24 now. Quick math. Much. 18, 18 plus 23. 23. Wait, plus five. hold on, I'm sort of. Plus five. 18 plus five. It's 2018. Yes. Plus five. Plus five. Plus five. 18 plus 5. 18 plus 5. 23. <laughs> How many did I drink? This is your I don't care. third? I don't care. Fourth? No, it's. Third. No. Fourth? Doesn't matter. 18 plus 5. <laughs> my, <fr> <laughs> my first entry for my new dorm room the night before my first day at Blackwell. Woo. I haven't had any time to write or even take pictures since I got here. My shit is in boxes all over the room. Which is smalls of mine and I never want to Why leave. did she shit in boxes? God damn it, I was going to make that joke literally as I finished this fucking sentence. I can't wait to decorate. <laughs> I plan a whole wall of photos. I did meet some of my dormmates, though I suck at remembering names, so I won't bother right now. But I think wow. I can already see who's going to be cool to me and who's not. It's a bitch trying to get settled into a new school and social scene after I finally found good friends in Seattle. But I'm here now and this is the start of my new life. Sweet dreams. Huh? Blackwell sucks ass. Oh, I told myself not to whine so soon, but damn, the day it's started the like Christmas day. morning. I barely had any dreams because I was so pumped to start my first official day of my new life. Like a dork, I couldn't figure out what to wear, so I chose what was, uh, what was on the floor. I'm no good with names and faces right away, but I picked up some names like Kate Brooke, Taylor, Alyssa. And how could I forget Victoria Chase? Rich, stylish, entitled, I could feel instant judgment when she looked at my raggedy-ass clothes. This is from Black, Black Oh, that's Welder. the bitch that fucking yeah, that's that short hair answered. Bitch. Yeah. As if I'm at Blackwell to strike fashion poses. Maybe I'm being extra crispy sensitive. Extra crispy sensitive. You know, so like, there are a lot of that's... parts. So there are a lot of parts about the dialogue that are like. Maybe this weird. is how. But like, also, real people talk like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, yeah. convincing to me. Real people talk like that one. But also, that sounds like a... Uh, Extra crispy sensitive. That it, sounds like a really shitty, uh... Like... Trojan condom. Extra crispy sensitive. I don't think that any Trojan... <laughs> like... Branch of condom would ever use the word crispy. Because that just sounds... That's why I said it was disgusting. shitty. Anyways, uh... I don't know. Dialogue is very convincing to me at a lot of parts. Yeah, Anyways. it sounds like it sounds like a real fucking angsty, eighteen year old, uh, doesn't know she's a lesbian student. yet. Yeah. Photography student for sure. It's highly critical of her own work. Yeah. Even though but I think like, Victoria wants life to be like her own reality show. Ugh. <laughs> the most convincing. I'm sorry. I didn't I'm... believe it was a real girl until ugh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm fucking. Anyways. So that wasn't fun along with my general social unease. I thought it would be easier like uh, being back. Called the Wambulance. I don't want this day to end all woe is Max. It was incredible to walk across the green, the green campus on the morning mist. I love the stone steps and brick walls of Blackwell. Everything is a picture to, uh, waiting to be taken. Speaking of, at least one great thing did happen today. Mr. Jefferson's photography class. Aww. There's more to tell, but journal forgive me. I'm truly wiped out. I have an ass load of homework already, so much bullshit, at least with us noobs. Except you said noobs in a context that was not gay and girl. Yeah. Is she uh, gay girl? No. I don't, I don't think so. Anyways. A day to acclimate. Don't take Acclimate is a good word. I use the word acclimate quite a bit. But to prove I'm not a total loser, I made a, a new friend in my science class. His name is Warren Graham, and he's a serious geek, plus he's dark and witty. Graham? Warren Graham. He comes across as kind of note of you know it all, but it turns out he does kind of know a lot. We talked about photographers, and he actually named a few I'd never heard of. We traded numbers, and he'll be a good study partner. Wait, real quick. Is Warren... Is he black? No. I okay. Because it says, plus he's dark and witty, and if he was black, <laughs> that would be the best way to describe him. Dude, his name's Graham. Warren. 
Uh, he's a serious geek. He's dark. <laughs> Anyways. I, I don't know, I thought that was good. I thought that was pretty good too. Uh, I'll need at least one based on- uh, I'll need at least one based on the click action here. I thought being 18 meant I didn't have to deal with this teenage drama, drama anymore. I thought. At least I get to research famous photographers for some of my homework. Mr. Jefferson assigned us a ton of reading, but this is act exactly what I want to study. Jefferson is super cool and super chill. He doesn't try to be too hip, just uh, says what he thinks and expects us to as well. I think he's a genius. Oh my god, I want to marry him. Just joking. This one class is worth all the social dysfunction. That wait, go back. That one, the one thing in the end reads like friend Monica. OMG, I want to marry him. OMG, I want that to marry him. That was a joke. Him. Just joking. This <laughs> <laughs> one class <laughs> is worth <laughs> all the social dysfunction. Homework is kicking my ass. I bet the teachers grade harder just to stop you from feeling special. But Victoria Chase and her snob minions still front like honored. What? Still what? front like their honored guests. <laughs> well, well, the, the bros here aren't that different. Nathan Prescott is Victoria. That's such a shitty name. Nathan Prescott? Nathan Prescott. That's like. What a fucking Chad ass motherfucker. Yeah. Name. I'm gonna. Wait. Do you see Chad him in this game? Prescott. You're goddamn right you do. Okay. My guess? Blonde. Go on. Uh, sweater tied around his neck. No. No? No. Is Different. he blonde? Yeah, he's blonde. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, he's blonde. Nathan if he Prescott is... If he doesn't have the sweater tied around his neck, then he's <clears throat> probably... Is he in shorts? Let me tell you. So he wears jeans? Okay. Uh, and the, uh... Fuck, where are they technically... What's the technical name for him? What? You know the high, the Letterman jacket. He's wearing a Letterman jacket. Ooh. Blonde Letterman jacket. Yeah, I can like, see that. That yeah. that that fits with Nathan Prescott. Prescott. Like, but it's not like, for like football. It's for like yeah, dude. I'm like varsity lacrosse. I play like I, I got kicked off the lacrosse team, but like it's whatever because like ultimate frisbee is like generally better sport all around, you know. Yeah, Plus like, the coach is a dick, so like here I am. Yeah, he's fucking my mom. <laughs> My stepdad kicked me off the team <laughs> because I didn't accept his authority. You're so loud. <laughs> the bros here are the different. Nathan Prescott is Victoria's male clone with way more money and attitude, if that's possible. His family is the oldest. Star I got. It has taken us how much? Eleven minutes to more read. More than that. I started. No, I started that when you started reading. Okay, cool. This is gonna be an entire episode of me fucking reading. That's yeah. Cool. So, his family is the oldest in Arcadia Bay, and I heard stories about them when I was a kid. The Prescotts give a shitload of bank to Blackwell. <clears throat> so Nathan acts like he literally owns the school. Yesterday during class, he put his feet on the desk, started texting, and the teacher didn't say Jack. I'd get suspended. But him and Victoria are part of the silly elite vortex club that puts on popular parties, <laughs> and so they get their way. It's good to be a king and queen. I imagine it went like this. <laughs> he, like, wiggled his toes. Get the fuck out of here with those gross feet. I'm sorry. I don't want to <laughs> slam everybody. I do like Kate Marsh. She's down the hall and in one of my classes. She's so pretty and sweet and friendly. She's gay. It makes her more beautiful than the biatches here. Like Victoria, think beauty is just your face and outfit. See, I'm already playing the drama games. No more. And this is September 23rd when she was like, I'm going to do more drama. Finally had a chance to take some actual shots around campus today. A perfect mm. blue sky day. I always forget how great I feel after I take pictures when I've been slacking off. Speaking of pictures, Mr. Jefferson told us about the National Everyday Heroes photo contest. He wants us all to enter. No. The winner gets a trip to San Francisco and lots of publicity. He wants just one photograph from each student. This is exactly why I wanted to come to Blackwell, and of course I'm scared shitless to enter. At least I have a couple weeks before the deadline in October, so I have plenty of time to stress and procrastinate. Besides, I don't know whether I love... I love it or hate it here. I'm trying to keep up with my science class of all things. Like I give a shit or even understand it. Good thing I know Warren. Too bad I can't clone him and take my place in class. No, he's dark. He's dark. <laughs> <laughs> Miss I don't Grant. See color. <laughs> oh god. Miss Grant is much cooler than the class. She explains particle physics so even boneheads like me can kind of understand. I love how she relates society to science and vice versa. I can tell she's committed and passionate about life. 
unlike some of us in our class, but I'm trying to engage more, even if it means asking actual questions in class instead of fighting them back. I'm just glad I'm not the only social misfit here. Now, how much homework are you avoiding? October, my favorite month. Best fucking weather of the year. Yeah. This is Tumblr the girl. She's a fucking photographer. Of course she's Tumblr the girl. <laughs> uh, my favorite month. The best weather of the year. I love watching the leaves change color, turning into tiny flames, but it's still too damn hot thanks to global warming. Flames. And I can't bust out the big coats Bitch, and sweaters or scary movies yet. She's in Oregon. Live in fucking California next time. Asshole. My beer got warm. Soon, Kit Let Me Borrow the October Country by Ray Bradford. Hey, I haven't read much by him, which caused Warren to almost revoke my Greek my Greek, Greek. my Greek cred before I held up no, my I'm copy Greek. of Battle Royale. Have you ever watched Battle Royale? Yeah, it's Japanese. That movie's the shit. I fucking love it. It was really cool. It's when, so no, it's not cool. It's when stupid. it starts off and they're like where we landed, boys. <laughs> You know, that's, that's what the movie actually is. You have seen it before, right? No. Holy shit. We can watch it tonight. It's on Netflix, right? I don't no, know. We're not going to watch it. It was on there, though. Fuck that. We're not going to actually. But, so, Battle Royale, that's exactly what it is. It's yeah. literally a bunch of kids it, are dropping well, on it's, it's It was the, the Hunger Games stole the, the thing from Battle Royale. Yeah. It's really funny. But it's like, it's like it's a Japanese movie, right? So it's all in... in... It's not in Japanese. It's actually in English. But, uh, is it? Yeah. But, like... Ooh. I, I'm, I'm sure, sure there's I a Japanese version, but no, nah, huh? English. Really fucking funny movie. Hmm. Anyways, uh, but he nails Maybe the autumn atmosphere of small towns. The last time I wore a Halloween costume was with Chloe. I have pictures in one of my old albums. I should find a real Halloween party to crash so I can experience some social mingling. Uh, it's that, it's that or a vortex club stroke fest sewing party. That sounds awesome. Stroke fest. Stroke fest. Or is that backstroke fest? Anyways, you so punny, Max. Uh, Don't. At least I'm trying to climb out of my cocoon. I shouldn't expect my life to completely change after a few weeks of Blackwell Academy. Because so my parents love telling me on a loop, you have all the time in the world. We did it. We read all of the diary. It took you 15 minutes to read eight pages. We could also read all the text messages. Dad, I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> have a very special 18th birthday. You're an adult now, but you're still a little girl. Check your account. Don't blow it all at once. Seven dollars. I need to read all of Kate Marsh's. Kate Marsh is a pretty cool character. Yeah. Hey, Max, you around? Always. You okay? Did you want to get tea later today? Absolutely. I'll be free after four. T-T-Y-L. Which means titty... Titty... Yes. Flick. Titty yes, Mom. Happy birthday, Maxine. I can't believe it's been 18 whole years since you are brought to us. Since I pushed you out of my fucking vagina. Warren! Wow. Do you want to meet for coffee after school? I need an excuse to not study. Please. Make sure you check out Necromantic on my flash drive. Mwahaha. Hey, Mad Max, let's bust shit up. Wait, I have to study for a physics test. So if we bust anything, we also have to measure its velocity. Don't ignore this message. This is the perfect representation of Alex texting Why have you done this? Why have you done this to me? Dude, right, we don't have do to you want to- wait, what, what the, I forgot where we were at. We're in your classroom. Yeah, we're back now. You just sat there on your phone for like 15 minutes and like, what the fuck are you doing? I can't believe she made Dude, steal that tablet. Class. What is she, 15 years old? And people laughed. Oh, no, people laugh at me. Victoria has to have the bestest, newest, most expensive everything. Oh, that's her shit? Don't touch her shit. Fuck that. She'll I'm looking at her fucking shit. $5,000? That's 5,299 monies. It's 5,000. It, it's, no, it's, it's put in really weird handwriting for like a website. Yeah, Alex, Anyways. it's 5,200 and gigot dollars. Gigot. Look at Etch marks. This might make a cool shot. Aww. Rachel Amber forever. That's what I need to fucking look up. So there are little like optional things to do. Yeah, you're gonna have that. You could take like a uh, like optional pictures. Yeah, because you know you're a fucking photographer. God, so fucking shitty. Dude, token of Life gratitude is a fucking feather. Those ca are covered in disease. Uh, like I fucking strange. love the little hedgehog. Uh, this game has a fucking wonderful style. It's he's very so nice. Cute. I know, he's very cute. His name's Harry. But he's British, so it's Harry. 
Harry. Harry Potter. Harry the Edgehog. It's Harry Potter. Ew. Did <laughs> you make it seem like he was Shadow? Harry Potter. The Edgehog. Shadow. The Edgehog. They don't, they don't pronounce the he's H. An H. He's an Edgehog. The H. Edgehog. Edgehog. Hi, Edgehog. Harry. Well, so if. Oh, hey, doing... Harry, you want to go get some tea in the mo- oh! <laughs> <laughs> If you're doing a cockney accent, <laughs> you don't pronounce the H. The H. But if you're doing a more proper accent, then you do. It's both pronounce the H. Posh. H. Cock. Posh. Cockney. Cockney. Cut that out. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this fucking slut over here, bending over over the table to fucking show him. Damn son, look at her wearing fucking socks over her leggings. Like what, what the fuck are even? you? She's the most stylish. Also, her hair looks like shit. It's not even the same color all the way throughout. Your roots are showing. It's because she's got the fuck. Bo- she has my haircut. She like shaves like the sides and the back and like. Oh, yeah. It's my fucking hair. Yeah, but yours doesn't. Yours isn't that. Mine fucking. isn't blonde, so you don't see like the dark roots. Because <laughs> everything is dark. Yeah. Uh, this Especially is Warren. An episode. Do you want to edit now or no? Yeah, we can end it now. Bye, guys. We didn't accomplish shit. Well, we we did the thing. We're gonna talk to Kate next. To Kate. She's the best. Oh my god. All right, bye, guys. Bye. Look at that. <laughs>